come install a front sway bar and adjustable end links on my right hand drive Miata. This upgrade will help with better handling on the track. The sway bar also comes with lateral locks. These are from Whiteline and I got them from Minjuka Racing. I took off the tray using a 10mm, then I moved on to the end links using a 14mm wrench and socket. Once I got the nut fully off the bolt, it kept hitting the axle so I used a rubber mallet and got her out the hard way. Onto the sway bar, I used a 12mm socket and removed two bolts on each side holding the brackets. Take a look at the old and new sway bars and just how crusty dusty the old bushings look compared to the new ones. The new sway bar also has two different mounting holes depending on how soft or stiff you like it. I put on the closer setting because of race car mode. We also have the new adjustable end links compared to the old ones with crusty bushings. The new bushings will need some lubricant on the inside. Once evenly distributed, put it on the sway bars and then yeet the sway bar right back in where you found it. Tighten the brackets loosely because you're going to have to wiggle it around for the end links. Put the end links in using new hardware and hand tighten. Then when everything is lined up, torque down the brackets to 20 foot pounds. Then put on the lateral collars 4 millimeters away from the bracket. Then lower the car and torque down the end links. Follow for more.